Good day to everybody. I am Phantom Darkness 135, your host for the evening. And home on break, so you can expect a few uploads this week. And today I'm bringing you a relatively new game called Arcade Escape. It's by uh, Nickelodeon Studios and AddictingGames.com. Um, Here are the instructions in case you forgot how to click the mouse. Alright, good enough. Here we go. Gonna get right into it. So, we're stuck in an arcade, and I, by the way, I don't have the sound on because there's really not a lot of sound in the game, so. We're going to pick up the pizza cutter, the ticket, and a napkin, and we're going to pick up a lot of tickets, 17 to be exact. And there's our second one was sticking out of there, and if we turn this way, you can look at the sign that basically gives a guide to how to get out of here. What it doesn't tell you is just how creepy that freaking mouse is, and number two, how to get out of here tells you what to do to get out of here. It doesn't tell you how to do it. That's what I'm here for. So we just picked up a ticket, a stamp pad, and another ticket. And the next thing we're going to do is play this game by pressing this red button. Filling that balloon up until it pops. Sorry if you can hear that mouse click. Almost there. This is fun. This is fun. And it goes. So something drops out. And it's a token, and gosh, that mouse just looks like Chuck E. Cheese went to prison. And anywho, we're going to take that fifth ticket and move along, kids. We're going to take that ticket. We're going to take that battery. We're going to put the token in this game. And we actually win at the claw game and get an alien. Yay! But we have to cut his head off. Boo! But we get a needle. Yay! Kids, be careful in claw games. We're going to take this ticket that looks like it's stuck inside, but it's not in this ticket that's sneakily put on there, if sneakily is indeed a word, and grab this broom, and move along to here, take another ticket, take a deflated basketball, another ticket, and turn to the right, another ticket, basketball pump, wonder what we use that for, bicycle pump rather, but... I think I just gave away what, what we're really going to use it for. So we got 13 tickets now. We're going to take this. Looks like a joystick, actually a ski ball. Take note. Well played. All right, and we get going to take this hand truck that for some reason comes up as a tiny master key. Okay. I'll take your word for it, and we're going to turn ourselves around, and what do we got so far? Oh, okay, so we're going to go play some basketball first. So pull up the bicycle pump first, actually. Put the needle on it. Attach to the basketball. Attach it to the basketball, there we go. And shoot for the hammer, but we can't reach it. we got to use the broom. The broom will help. And it's actually the hammer for the... Actually, we'll play skee ball first. So we got a pretty crappy aim, actually. And we get another ticket and a screwdriver, though. This is very hazardous to children. There's needles in the toys. There's screwdrivers. Anyway, so now we play the Creepy Mouse Whack-A-Mole game. And ooh, you want to grab that black light and not forget about it like I did. And it really doesn't matter what score you get, you just want to pay attention to what holes they're coming out of. So I'm just going to go ahead and tell you it's this one, this one, this one, this one, and this one. Now, what we're going to do with that little bit of info is use the hand truck slash weird tiny master key to take this thing out, light up this stuff. Those are the same holes that the uh, mice were popping out of, and get the gold key, which is probably the true master key. And then turn to your left. We're going to take the kickboard off the store. It does this screwdriver, surprisingly, unlike in uh, most escape games, doesn't work on the grate over there. It's actually used for this because it's a Phillips head. And you want to take the kick plate. It'll automatically take that. And then you want to pick up the screws and the ticket. And then, actually, I forgot to take my ticket from here. Just take it there. And then we get our tickets from over here. Yes, yes, good. We still need one more ticket, and it's right there. Gotcha. All right, so now that we have our 17 tickets, we can put them in the ticket counter, press the button, get our receipt. 
bring it over here. Oh, too far. Too far again. And place it over the stamp thing to get the hand stamp. And obviously, we're going to use that on the stamp pad to ink it, and then use that on the napkin we found at the beginning of the game to get a code. But then we can't see it, so we have to use a black light with battery included. Oops. With battery included. Turned it on and use it there. 8812. Not so obviously. We're going to put the kickboard up here. Put the screws there and then screw it back on there. And then twist the gun by clicking on the barrel or the uh, butt of it. And then hit the red button again. The water will drip down, disabling the alarm. And now we're set. We got the gold key. We got the code 8812. And we're out of here. Oh no! Actually, I didn't notice that the first time I played it. That's pretty cool. What happens? Oh, nothing. Cool. Alright, everybody. That was a uh, quick walkthrough of Arcade Escape from Addicting Games in Nickelodeon. Hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for tolerating my annoying voice and antics. And coming over to watch the channel. Please check out our other videos. Check out our channel and our Facebook page if you're so inclined. And really, just have a great week. I'm Phantom Darkness 135. I'm out of here once again.